Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you install a fuel filter assembly on your engine, first make sure the engine has cooled. Next, you should remove the wire and boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting. You should perform this procedure with no fuel in the tank. Use a 5 16th inch socket or nut driver to unthread the screw securing the air filter cover. Remove the cover and the filter, then use a Phillips head screwdriver to remove the screw securing the carburetor cover. Pull the cover off and remove the three screws securing the air filter housing. Detach the breather tube to release the housing. Now use pliers to release the retaining clamps securing the old fuel line to the tank and the carburetor. Pull the fuel line off. Be prepared for some fuel to spill. Prepare the new fuel filter and line assembly for installation by trimming the new line to match the length of the old one. Now attach the short end of the fuel line to the port on the tank and the longer end to the carburetor. Secure the line with the retaining clamps. Confirm that the gasket is in place on the air filter housing, then attach the breather tube to the breather post and realign the housing. Rethread the screws and torque them to three and a half foot pounds. Realign the carburetor cover and rethread the screw. With the filter in place, reposition the filter cover and rethread the screw to secure. With the repair completed, Reattach the wire and boot to the spark plug, refill the fuel tank, and your engine should be ready for use.